So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk him around the block, let him go to the bathroom, and then we're going to the train. He's never been on the train. If he's nervous, he's still going on the train. That's one, that's one of the reasons why I'm taking him around the block to go to the bathroom and everything. The dog that's empty is less apt to be nervous. Okay, he doesn't have to worry about, oh shit, I'm gonna have to pee or take a dump on the train. He knows that that wouldn't be good, right, Pharaoh? Yeah, he knows. He has to behave. I'm a, I got my cane with me. I'm a, I'm a fucking invalid. He's my service dog. He better be good. And that's sort of the attitude with all the dogs. You better be good, you know? We're still going on the train. You gotta get used to it, brother. Doing a pretty good heel. So we'll see if he takes a dump and then we're off to the train. Right, Pharaoh? No more Sherpa bag for the Pharaoh, King Pharaoh. Right, right. right. Here comes a dog dragging its owner, all right? So, and they're making a beeline for Pharaoh. Bro, you better behave, brother. Oh, the guy's just, the dog's dragging him, you know? I don't know, let's see what Pharaoh, Pharaoh's not gonna do anything. leaving the dog alone. No. Dog is 10 feet away. Heel. It's my boy. It's the baby man. Will he behave on the train? He better. He better or else I'm going to tell his mommy that he did something bad on the train. Doing a nice heel. I'm waiting on a service vest for Luna. Oh, that dog's ridiculous on the train. Everybody's trying to pet it. They wouldn't leave her alone. Might happen with the baby man too. He's pretty cute. Now, he's already been up in the station before, so, and he has also climbed the steps. He's going to do this because I'm telling him to. Baby man, you better do it. So, oh, there's another dog. It's a Brittany. Brittany puppy. Or is it a, yeah, it's a Brittany puppy. He jumped the first two steps. He's looking forward to the train ride. Well, he's acting like this is the 15th time he's done it. Oh, look, I'm on the train. Now, um, we're going to stay down at this end because the train will slow down more, right? And I'll just stand here with him, with our backs against the wall. Sit. That way he can see the train coming. You got it? No surprises. We'll do it. I'm gonna do some leash flexing as, it, as the train comes in. 
Sit. Good boy. Oh, you're good, dude. Nice job. Sit. Good. 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 Trains packed. Fucking awesome. Heel. I'll repeat that one, fucking awesome. It's pretty good. Oh yeah, baby man. Pretty good too, Paul. You got him. Heel. Sit. Drop. Now oh, hold. Heel. Hold. Now come up. Hold. Hold. Sit. Hold. Drop. Do it again. Let's get you a good one. Hold. Heel. Hold. Sit. Hold. Drop. We missed our train. Pulled away just as we were coming down the steps. I knew it arrived. I was working with the baby man. He was picking up my glasses and shit. You know? Really? You know, it's in a su subway station. Really a lot of distractions. There's construction going up there. Going on up there. Somebody was using a Sawzall. You know? It's pretty good. He did real good. It's about as heavy of a distraction as you're gonna get. A subway station in Brooklyn, construction going on. It's clearly not fucking around. It's a baby man. No more, no more riding in a Sherpa like a little baby. He's a baby man. Look at him. What a ridiculous little dog, seriously. Look at this guy. He's a fucking badass, seriously. He doesn't like Donald Trump, told me that. He doesn't like pit bulls. He doesn't give a shit what people think, that's what he said. He said, I don't care what anybody thinks. He doesn't like pits, and he doesn't like Donald Trump. He's got great hair. He does. His mom's probably gonna go have him cut, but I, I like him looking all unkempt. The grunt, the grunge band is here. This guy and his girlfriend. Farrell, you're a good boy. His mom told me that when she would take him on the train, she'd have him in a Sherpa bag, and if he saw a dog, he'd start being a dick in the Sherpa bag. Yeah, you can't correct the dog in the Sherpa bag, you know. So that just encouraged that behavior, that leash aggression. Oh, there's a dog. As soon as I see, see a, or he sees a dog, and I see that he sees a dog, I, like, remind him I'm here and not to do it, you know. Don't do that. We're going this way. Right, Pharaoh? He once again said that he thinks Donald Trump is guilty and smells like shit. 
It's probably into shit. It's clearly into pee. It's, that's what it says in the dossier that he's into. I can, I can only hope that that's, Putin, that's one of the things that Putin has on him. What's in the dossier? The prostitutes peeing on the bed. It's, it's sort of believable. Sure, why not? I mean, I'm not saying I'm into it. I'm just saying that I think that that's probably one of the more common things. You know, the golden shower. I mean, it's not like, um, what's something that's uncommon? Oh, shit eaters. Yeah. This is true. I had a roommate that was a dominatrix. Two of them. Just by happenstance. I'm in New York City. They had to make money. And both of them told me about the poo-poo platter. Said it was mostly Wall Street guys that would come down and order it. A saltine. It was on a saltine. No correction or ne leash flexing needed. He was just smelling the train. Yeah. The tiny little baby man is awesome on the train. Seriously. They can take Amtrak. He's a service dog. He can take an airplane too. No, sit. Not supposed to sniff strangers, baby man. He walked on the train like he owned it. The truth. Like he's the king. Yes, yeah, he's King Pharaoh. He's not fucking around. He, he said that he wants to go on an Amtrak trip with his mommy. That's what he said. Yep, he said with his mommy. Yeah, he got a hundred on this. Seriously, he did real good.